Hello, hello, hello. Kurt here with Teach Mom How. I was asked the question, how do I download iMovie? So that's why I'm going to show you this today. So let's dive right in. And if you already have iMovie on your computer, go ahead and skip it in the description. Skip to my playlist with all my in-depth iMovie tutorials. Okay? So it's really simple. I'll show you on a Mac and an iPhone how to download iMovie. So on a Mac, go to the App Store, which you will either find in your dock, it's right here, or if it's not in your dock, you'll find it in Launchpad, which is right here. But find the App Store, looks like this, blue box with an A. Okay, find the App Store. And once you're in the App Store, by the way, this is also how you check for iMovie updates. If you've already got it, you may want to do this anyways iMovie, search iMovie, and uh, it will find it. Okay, if it, it'll either say open, which means that you have it and it's up to date, or it'll say get, which means you need to download it, or it will say update, which means you need an update to it. Okay, so in my case, I'm just going to click open. In your case, it would say get, but this is a different editor. This is not iMovie. Okay. So if you don't have iMovie, just click Get, and it will start to download. Once it finishes downloading, uh, you'll just it, it auto-installs, actually, I believe. Um, if it doesn't, you will get a file called a DMG file. If it doesn't auto-install, if it auto-installs like I think it will, I don't want to delete mine to test it, um, but if you have questions, leave a comment. Uh, so if it auto installs, then it'll just say open here, or you'll have it right here in, uh, and I'm 99% sure it'll auto install. So once you've downloaded it, you'll come to Launchpad, this right here, and you'll see iMovie. If it didn't auto install for some reason, if I'm wrong, it will be in your downloads folder in Finder. And uh, in my last video that I made today, you saw me install this DVD burner. It'll be a DMG file. Mac programs are DMG files. Um, PCs are EXE files, I believe. Anyways, you double click that and that will start the installation process and that will install it to your applications folder, which by default puts it in Launchpad, okay? So hopefully that helped, and now you can download iMovie or update iMovie if you've already got it.